happening around the Ozarks. The food will be rolling into Branson this weekend, literally, as the Food Truck Festival of America kicks off Saturday at Tanger Outlet. Color 10's Crystal Blair joins us live now in Branson at Tanger Outlet with more. Crystal, what's going on down there right now? Well, right now, I'm telling you, they are expecting thousands of people to be here tomorrow for the Food Truck Festival of America here at Tanger Outlets. You can see they're getting ready tomorrow. You got Kona Ice and Chicken Wings 3. Chicken Wings. They taste better than the wings, actually. Look, they even got me dressed up and ready. I guess they think I'm going to go to work, too. Three words. Food, beer, fun. What else do you need? Tomorrow, Tanger Outlet will not only be the place for a Saturday shopping spree, but it will also be the place to indulge in all types of food and beer from local as well as national food truck vendors. The festival started back in 2011 in an effort to introduce people to the gourmet food truck business while supporting the small business owners who run them. Now, this is the first time Tanger Outlet has teamed up with the food truck festival. They're trying it at four other Tanger locations around the nation. Anne Marie Eigner is the founder of food truck festivals. She says that they are prepared for tomorrow's expected heat. It's going to be warm, so we do give tips on how to do a food truck and craft beer festival. Elastic waistbands, leave the diet at home, uh, come hydrated, but we'll have plenty of water. Uh, we have a bunch of uh, shade tents as well. A bunch of amazing food trucks, some local, uh, some from outside the markets. Now, there are going to be a ton of food trucks here, so I'm going to just name a few for you. Of course, you have chicken wings and Kona ice, twisted tacos, Spork Express, Gooey's grilled cheese, and fresh golf shrimp. I am hungry right now. Now, I put ticket information at OzarksFirst.com. There are situations where you can get in free if you are a military first responder with the proper ID. Reporting live in Branson, Crystal Blair, Colorton News, Ozarks First.